Hello everyone, welcome to another Roblox video and today I'll be comparing two of my personal and maybe one of the best zombies game there is on Roblox. This is also a voice reveal, so... To start off the video, the two main games that I would like to introduce are Recoil Zombies and Michael Zombies. Obviously, both games are round based and you can either play solo or multiplayer. Both games have many types of maps and can include many leveling perks. Now that we introduced these games, we are now gonna compare them. We are now gonna compare which game has a darker and scarier vibe. Now, I believe Recoil Zombies has a more darker vibe only because when you start off the game, you start hearing these screaming noises. You just hear the zombies start starting to come at you. The lighting is like very dark and that's almost exactly the same as Nocter on Toten from the original Black Ops 1. So I guess we're gonna have to check um, Michael Zombies to see if it's any better than Rico Zombies, but I believe that maybe Rico Zombies will pass this first review. Now here we are at Michael Zombies. Now Michael Zombies doesn't really have a spooky vibe, though the zombies are pretty scary con considering that it still has World War II uh, zombie-like figures. Now considering that it has a robot cat on this um, undead nocturne, um, doesn't really sense that scariness in the game, but like I still pretty much enjoy it. It's, you know, it's just an average game, average zombie game, I might say. So I guess I'm gonna have to give this one to Recoil Zombies, and yeah. So far, the current score is 1-0, and Recoil Zombies is winning this one. And now we are gonna review the graphics and pretty much how the gameplay feels for mobile and PC. First, we're gonna check out Michael Zombies now. A little fact is that I unfortunately do not have any video tape of for PC version. Although I do have a PC, my storage is pretty full, so I don't have footage for any of that. But I will speak for it and how the mobile controls can also feel like. So starting off with Michael Zombies, the mobile controls are actually surprisingly good. You can adjust them in settings. Um, depending how you like them, you can actually adjust them, which is actually pretty cool. Make Making your gameplay pretty much more comfortable, and that's what I really like about it. And for the graphics, it's pretty good. Even for an FPS game, it um, doesn't really take up much storage. Like the pre for graphics, pretty good, and playing on food on iPhone pretty smoothly, it's pretty impressive, and now we're just gonna have to check out Recoil Zombies and compare which one might go for it. Now for Recoil Zombies, the mobile controls are really good, they're honestly really good, but there is one downside, there is a really annoying aim assist on mobile. Fortunately, it does not have that problem with PC, but I'm hoping the devs will fix it, but developers of Rico Zombies haven't been really that much active, considering that the, its last update was less than a year ago, I guess, I think, but like, overall, I really think that the game graphics are really good as well, considering it's like, these Fortnite figures, like, COD figures and stuff these bloxy ones so i believe it's really good and we're just gonna have to see the like i said the only downside is the aim assist so honestly i think i'm gonna have to give this one to michael zombies now the review on the wonder weapons now michael zombies has more wonder weapons than retail zombies only because rico zombies only has three wonder weapons which is the ray gun the Thunder Gun and the Wonder Waffer. And Michael Zombies has the Ray Gun, the Wonder Waffer, uh, Flame Doors, and a few very OP LMGs. But um, 
Michael's Zombies does not have the Thunder Gun, the Thunder Gun, only because I believe the devs, the developers of the game, um, may crash or like make the gameplay even worse because it's a lot of scripting and I think that's one thing about it. And honestly, it's not even that, that much of a problem because the Wonder Weapons are pretty much more OP in my opinion, are more OP than Rico Zombies, which it's not that bad. Both games are pretty good, but I think I'm going to have to give this one to Michael Zombies. Now for the pack punch systems, I'm automatically have to go with Rico Zombies because you can actually pack a punch your gun three times. You heard me right. Three times. That's upgrading your weapon three times. Like, that's insane. While Michael Zombies, you can only pack a punch at one time, like regular Black Ops, but it's still unbelievable and it's really OP. So I'm automatically have to go with Recall Zombies on this one. Now, which zombie game won? Well, no one, cause neither one. It was a tie, and that's because both same zombie games are really good. Uh, consider trying and play play the game it's really fun the reason I gave it a tie is like it's impossible to compare these two games it's really fun but I'm happy to hear some opinions down below in the comments and overall they're both really good games um, I'll be doing some more gameplay videos on these and now that I compare them I will be posting more of zombie zombies games on Roblox and some other FPS games and some news. I will no longer be doing there's the survival game content only because it, the game basically died and it's not that funny anymore. There's it's not that enjoyable, but overall I made some great memories with it. I made some friends along the way and yeah it's it was a nice journey but i'm moving on now to get some make some better content and i believe that this will make some content um um, um call of duty mobile wasn't really a big hit so i'm gonna have to stick with um roblox and that's pretty much it for the video guys thank you guys for watching um, I would like to hear some opinions down in the comments if this was a good video and I don't know um, So like thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video